Bryce, are you 100% recovered from your injury? Uh, yes, yeah, so just about, I'd say around 90s, 97, somewhere in there. So, yeah, I'm good. Did it ever bother your shot? Uh, early, early, it was a little difficult. I had to do a little extra, like on my wrist motion to get the full extension. But now, now it's pretty, it's pretty smooth. Hey, Bryce, I, I know you're a big Kobe fan and, and that's been well documented. And now that we've had a chance to see you play, there's a little bit of that in your game. Is, does that come natural? I mean, the, the mannerisms and the things you do, is that just you being you? Or did you purposely try to pick those things up from, from what he did and how he played and, and try to carry those into your game? Uh, I think it's just because of, uh, you know, I watched a lot of film on Kobe. So I think, you know, the more I watch, the more I naturally just end up doing those things on the court. So I think that's just kind of where it stems from. Do you catch yourself doing it? Are, are you even aware when, when you do those things? Uh, yeah, yeah, sometimes I will. Sometimes I will. And Coach Coach Howard will always remind me, be like, this dude look like Kobe right here. Just <laughs> like the way I'm standing or bending over. Or like I got my jersey in my mouth for just some little stuff like that. Yeah, it, it really seems to have shown up in the last month or so. I mean, does it correlate to you being more comfortable and, and more confident at this level and with your role? Definitely, definitely. Just keep – I got to keep gaining confidence as I play and – just keep, just keep doing me and, you know, we'll be good. How do you feel? I mean, it, you know, do you know, do you feel comfortable how your role is defined and, and what you can do for this team? Yes, I, I'm extremely comfortable. You know, I'm excited. I think we got a, a great group and I think we can do some magical things in March. In your opinion, what is the role of the reserve players? Uh, usually to come in, you know, provide a spark, you know, to try to uplift us and, you know, just give us a little boost. And I think that's pretty much it. Hey Bryce, as you kind of you know, as, this, as the regular season comes to an end, you guys get ready for the postseason. For your first season here at Kansas, could you you know go, going through all the COVID nineteen protocols and you know to get to this point, you know to make it almost the Big Twelve tournament? Can you just kind of reflect on what it's been like as a freshman and having to basically change your lifestyle as a college freshman myself? It's obviously been a little different, but yeah, yeah, definitely, it's been it's been extremely difficult. I mean, or not difficult, it's different. I mean just stuff that I'm not used to, you know, testing every other day, you know, uh, you know, wearing your mask everywhere. You know, I can't sit next to my teammates all the way in the locker room. Just a lot of different stuff that COVID has, has impacted. It's been really different, but you know, we've been able to adjust well and uh, I think we've been doing a great job with it. What, what do you see as kind of your role in maybe taking some of the, the pressure off of, of Marcus? Definitely, definitely. You know, he's he's our main guy. You know, he gets tired. So, you know, I got to be able to come in, you know, handle the ball, get us in the offense and, you know, just, just hold it down, basically. Bryce, as one of the two freshmen that are in rotation, you and Dewan, how does that dynamic duo happen? Is it natural for you guys to play well together or how did that happen? Yeah, I think it's just natural. You know, we're both, you know, both pretty good players. I think we just bounce off of each other. You know, we get in, we bring energy, and we just, just kind of do what we do. And I think I really do enjoy playing with them. Hey, Bryce, earlier this week, Marcus talked about a moment uh, when you guys were struggling and you guys came together and had sort of a team meeting where you talked about doing what coach told you to do. I just wondered what you remembered about that particular day. Uh, I just remember it was very good. You know, we we've definitely learned from, as you can see, we're playing a lot better now, but it was, it was a time where we were struggling a little bit, you know, and we just had to come together like men and talk about it and address it. And, and I think we did that and we're seeing the benefits of it now. I wonder too, coach has talked about your guys is uh, changing up the ball screen defenses for a guard who is having to either stop the roller or play the backs out of it. Um, you know, how comfortable are you guys with that now? And that, that change that you made? Uh, it was a little, it was a little tough early, but I mean, in practice we were repping it over and over. So now it's, now it's pretty easy. Now I kind of, I'm kind of used to it, and I'm just able just to read and react quickly. So, Bryce, you guys are obviously hot, hitting your stride at the right time. Is there something you still want to learn about this team? Maybe a, you know, a question or two that that you think you guys still need to answer before you get to the postseason? Uh, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I think, I think being able to, you know, just to get out to great starts every game, you know, cause as we can continue to go, you know, we're going to be playing great teams and it's going to be tough if, if we're behind and playing behind the whole game. So I think just continuing to be able to get out to great starts and be able to carry that momentum throughout the game. I also want to ask you, has anybody on this team talked to you about, you know, what you do bring to this group? I mean, you, you know, your minutes are, 
modest, right? Your points are mm-hmm. modest, uh, but but the record with you in the lineup is much better than with you out. So <laughs> has anybody said, hey, we need you. We, we, we like having you. I mean, have your teammates or anybody talked to you about that kind of, yeah. that kind of action? Yeah, mostly uh, just everybody, you know, just letting me, letting me know that, you know, that I, I mean something, you know, that I bring something to the table and that, you know, we're better with me, we're better with me uh, in the lineup, like you said. Bryce, with the Big 12 tournament coming, out, coming up next week, how does it feel to be about to play your first Big 12? And, of course, March is around the corner. Are you excited to be a part of March Madness? Yes, man. I'm I'm extremely excited. You know, I've been working really hard. We've been working really hard for this for this moment, and we're just ready just to take it on and just see what we can do. Bryce, what have you seen from? Oh, sorry. I was one question, Bryce. What have you seen from UTEP? Uh, I've only seen a little bit. You know, today in practice, we'll go over their um, we'll go over their plays and all that stuff, and then we'll have film later tonight. So I'll get a better grasp grasp of them tonight, and I'll be able to watch some extra film of my own to get ready for tomorrow. All right, thank you, Bryce. All right, thank you, guys. Thanks, Bryce.